Now we're going to talk about a simple function that's built into C++ called the exit function. And this is really just used to exit a program completely. Um, usually used when um, there's an error in the program uh, that cannot be recovered. Um, books tend to use it in odd places or places maybe not the greatest place um, or show it used in a place that eventually we'll get rid of but students seem to have a habit of keeping those habits around bad habits um, so the book shows you to use it a lot of books show you to use it for when there's an invalid input okay at first before we know how to actually validate input doing that maybe is okay but once you know how to validate input, you should be handling the invalid inputs. It's not really a reason to exit a program. But again, all the exit function does is exit the program. So here's a program we've been using. I place the exit function anywhere in the program. That's when the program will end. So the rest of this code, after the statement of the exit, will never execute. So if I was to run this right now, it will prompt me for one input and then end. So I'll go ahead and compile that. So it's in this example, which is kind of silly where I placed it, but it just ends. Right? I can place the end anywhere in here. I can place it in one of the functions if I want, and it'll end at that point. Right? So here's that program running. It's going to ask me for the one value. To, I'll put something invalid so you show, show you it stays oops, within that loop there. Then as soon as it has something valid, the program just ends. It ends cleanly. doesn't crash. Um, but it's not the greatest thing to use all the time. It's typically used for when there's a very bad situation. The program needs to end abruptly. Um, things may not get cleaned up nicely if you just do an exit, especially when we get into objects and stuff of that nature that need to clean up themselves. All right, so that's all it is. is a quick way to get out of a program when you need to. Right, and it skips all the code that's after it. It's an immediate exit. It won't return anywhere. It won't do anything. It just ends the program right where that statement is.